What's up guys, it's this guy back at it again for another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a name spiral. It's basically the same as our other spiral we did in the third episode or yeah, third episode, yeah. So it's basically the same and but this time it's actually going to print your name. So let's get into the video. So the first thing you want to do is write import turtle. And that's basically going to import turtle. And yeah, so now we're going to assign turtle as T. So T is equal to turtle. dot pen parentheses just leave it like that and now let's move on turtle dot bg color so that's a background color it's basically like the first and second i mean the third and the second video i mean the episode we did so it's basically the same code except we're gonna switch it up a little bit so now we're gonna do colors equal to bracket open close red comma yellow Comma, blue. Comma, oh yeah, make sure you put the quotes in, so we can put it in as a string. And then quotes, double quotes, green. Comma. Orange, comma, purple, basically we just have to put in 10 colors because we're going to list the sides from 1 to 10, so yeah, it may take a while, white, Brown. And aqua. So basically, it's listing out all the colors so we're gonna add a piece of code which is gonna ask how many sides you want it to be so depending on the sides it's gonna go in order so if i put in three um, sides it's gonna go in red yellow blue if i put in all 10 sides it's gonna go through the whole list so yeah you can shorten it if you want you can do one to five or something of that sort and yeah so now we're gonna put in the your so we're, now we're gonna put in the code for the name so it's gonna ask the name your name so space equal to turtle dot text input colon I mean not colon parentheses and then put in your quotes any kind of quotes will work as long as you keep them the same enter 
your name. Now we're gonna put a comma, hit a space, another set of quotes. We're gonna do what is your name? Then question mark and that's that line. Okay, so now it's going to ask how many sides we want. So it's, we're going to put in the code for how many sides we want. So sides space equal to space integer, well, int. That's something new. Uh, turtle dot num input then another parentheses number of sides now we can add a comma we can put in how many sides do you want? Um, parentheses one to ten. Close the parentheses, question mark, and close the parentheses. I mean, not close it. We're going to do a comma, then five, another comma after five, one, then a ten. So five is going to be a preset when it asks us, then we can change it from there. Okay, so now we're almost done. We're going to do 4x in range parentheses 100. So it's going to print it 100 times. So now make sure it's indented. So hit tab and it goes four spaces. So t dot pen color. Colors, parentheses, colors, a bracket, X, percentage, sides, percentage, 10. Close the bracket, close the parentheses up. Now we can move on to the next one. So T dot pen up make sure there's no spaces parentheses open and close then we're going to do t dot forward parentheses open and close x times 4 okay now we're going to do pen down okay t dot pen down Open and close your parentheses. And we're almost there. This is where it's going to print out in the type of font you want. So it's this is where it's going to print out. So T dot write parentheses your underscore name comma space font so this is going to be the f spot where you can change things so python has a special set of fonts which are only like usable so you can't do like any of the like you can for example you can't do impact impact doesn't work uh 
only a select few work in Python, so we're just gonna go with times, so it's gonna be times new Roman. Or you can do Arial. Just write in Arial with a cap. I mean a capital A. So integer int parentheses open and close. I mean no, just leave it open. Space another parentheses x times two plus four. Now we're gonna close that up and we're gonna do a slash a, and then another four and we can close that up and now it's we're gonna ask it to print in bold so we can do two quotes and write bold okay now we can just close the parentheses up, another space, close that one up, and just one more line of code and you'll see how amazing it is. So t dot left quotes, open and close, now we're going to write inside of the quote, I mean the parentheses, 360. So it's going to do like a 360. It's going to spin around sides plus two. And there we go. So let's double check import turtle T is equal to turtle dot pen. Okay. Background color black colors, red, yellow, blue, green, orange, purple, white, gray, brown, aqua. Your name is equal to turtle dot text input. Enter your name. What is your name? Sides integer turtle dot num input number num stands for number num input number of sides. How many sides do you want from one to ten question mark five ten five one ten then for x in range 100 t dot pen color let's check there t dot pen colors x percentage sides percentage 10 okay pen up t dot forward x times 4 t dot pen down t dot write your name font a font okay Arial well I did times well why don't we just switch it up to Arial I think it might look better okay so Arial comma integer um, parentheses yeah looks all good so we can hit the run and it's going to ask us to save it so we can do it as name spiral dot py so we know it's a python file and I'm not going to put a space in between this let's just leave it like that and it's going to save to my desktop and x looks like we have another syntax error. Okay, for x in range 100. In range. Forgot a colon. Okay, now it works. So, my bad guys. Just, just put a colon here. So, let's go over here. Python, what is your name? My name is this guy. Okay, how many? See, there's gonna be a preset, so as five, so we're gonna put it in as ten, cause ten looks the best. And look at that! That is amazing. Wow. 
you can see that it goes from small to big and it's going to fill up to a hundred times so yeah that's pretty cool you can see the little arrow switching colors every time or the turtle whatever you want to call it so yeah thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and have a great day see ya